Okay guys, before the video starts, please make sure to go to Discord and under the development category there should be a channel called Framework and there should be a file that you should download. Here's a reference image of how it's supposed to be set up in Roblox. And also please make sure that your HTTP and API services are turned on in your game settings. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to set up the identification card. So, before you start, you would have to set up the framework. You would have to have these three files, make sure you have these three files. Okay, and to begin, you have to extract all of these into the required spaces. So, this has to go into the replicated storage, this has to go into server script, this has to go in startup player scripts. Okay, so mine is already set up. So, once that's set up, you guys can take these two. You can just take those two folders and into the replicated storage into system and you can just paste them. Okay, so I already have a another notification system folder. So you guys just wanna have one. So you guys can just delete that. And um, let's let's see if it works. Oh, my bad, I, I missed something. Okay, so you have to go into the um, identification card tool. And here, under the readme, there will be a license. You guys just want to take that and put that in the start pack. Okay, there we go. So as you guys can see, this is the license. You guys can also configure it to your own needs. So, um, okay, in the config, you guys can change like the state, the country, and yeah. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you guys require any assistance, feel free to contact us in the Discord.